Harry, Harry. You see, you are my elder brother. So it will be so uncultured to be a daggers drawn with you over the throne. So I'm here to make a proposal. Allow me be king and I promise you after my reign, your sons will continue your legacy. I come in peace. Mm -hmm. You come in peace. Are you done flexing your muscles? The last time we met, we were at Daga's drawn. You willingly gave up the throne. I begged you to reconsider, but you insisted. Are you happy now? Mm -hmm. Mother, no, come to me! Are you happy now? Mother, please take it easy. You have only waited for so long to speak with you. You waited for so long to speak with his crown heir. Eh? Mother, take it easy. Mother, take it easy. Why can I take it easy? Stop telling me that! How can I take it easy? How? How? Okay, fine. Sit, sit down. Oh, no. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. Sit down. <laughs> no, 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 I can't take it. Leave me alone! Ah! No, 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 Call you to give you the good news. Our family is about to be on the top pedestal of the state. This family is about to become a bad block. That's going to make us proud. Now you're not here to see all of this, I'm sorry. <laughs> I was told you're back. But I wanted to speak with you so badly, but you were nowhere to be found. Sorry. There were circumstances beyond my control. I, I didn't do this intentionally.
How could father leave us like this? He had so much life in him. He's not supposed to die now. It's okay, Victor. Remember, father prepared us for this. My friend, my friend, you have beautiful clothes in here. I don't even know which to choose right now. Hey, which do I choose? Oh, they are so fine. I like this one. How much is this? Sandra, wait. Did something happen in your family? You don't even know. I don't understand. Everything was fine before I left the house. Okay, if you say so, fine. Which one is okay, if you say so, fine? This is what I don't like about you. I hate this attitude of yours. It disgusts me. If you want to say something, say something. Stop going through the corners. Look in my face and tell me what it is. What's the problem? Hey, okay. your father-in-law is dead. The news is everywhere. Yes. Twenty missed calls. I'll be right back. Hello, honey. Honey, is it true? Yeah, what happened? What kind of friend is this? She's not even aware of what is happening in her family. God. Oh, wow. Before ma, come and take this thing back. Fast. Hey. Sandra, you can never change. I went to very well, okay? Uh, mother, I've been looking everywhere for you. Mother, I've been looking for you everywhere. I was told you didn't want to eat your food. What's going on? How do I eat? Well, tell me, how, how do you expect me to eat? I, I feel so empty. I don't even know what to do. Your father leave me at a time like this. I don't, I don't, I don't even know what to do. Don't talk like that. I understand how you feel. I, okay, yes, that is normal. But you want to leave us like you did. I am here for you, Victor Harry. We are all here for you. Okay. Please, take it easy. Mother. <laughs> I always take care of you. Okay, come. So you can eat your food. And you know you have to take your drugs. Yeah. Mono. Yeah. Mono. Yeah. Mono. Yeah. Mono. Yeah. Mono. Yeah. Oh God, they don't know man. <laughs> On behalf of myself, my younger brother Victor here, and the entire family, we wish to offer a profound gratitude to all of you for the very important roles you played during my father's burial. We do not take that for granted. We wish to say we appreciate and. Um, 
Thank you very much. Thank you, Prince Harry. Thank you. And Prince Victor. Hello, you're welcome. On behalf of the Council of Elders, I convey our sincere and heartfelt condolence to the family. King Godwin was a man of peace, a man of integrity, and successful too. He loved our kingdom with all his heart. We will surely miss him. Oh. May his gentle soul rest in perfect peace. Amen. According to our tradition, our throne is vacant and need to be filled. Yes, right. Prince Harry, you are the next to be crowned king. Long live the king. Listen, Harry, I know you're not too excited about Onowu's earlier announcement. I totally understand. But life goes on. I'm not interested in the throne. Sorry? What, what did you just say? Listen, Victor, I have been nominated as the flag bearer by my party for the next gubernatorial elections. That means I am this close to becoming the next governor of the state. Something I've dreamt of all my life. I've dreamt about this since the first day I entered politics. As you can see, the polls are in my favor. It's a good thing. But you could still become the governor and also king at the same time. <laughs> what, what nonsense are you talking about, Victor? How does one become king and governor at the same time? <laughs> no, but I'm sure there's a way around this. It could work. It could. Anyways, I have no such intentions. Okay? I do not wish to let this opportunity pass us by. I intend to be governor. That's my utmost desire. Moreover, you and I are brothers, so the kingship can still remain in the family. I... I don't understand. What do you mean by that? Take up the throne. What? Harry... From me to you. Your Highness. <laughs> Take up the throne, bro. He's still in the family. Excellency, you my Excellency, Sorry, Mama. Mama, you really need to stop this High Excellency thing you are doing, you know. Stop it. 
Stop, Kwaifa. Shut up! Huh. Okay, what do you know? Huh? I, I know a lot. I know a lot. I also know that fake pretense and fake assumption of who you are not is a big crime in the society. And it might make people to have bad intentions for you. What a great cabo, what a great. Listen. My son in law is the incoming governor of this state. And he has assured me of my security. Yeah. So relax. What then wait. <laughs> Wait till he becomes the governor of the state. Wait till he becomes the governor. Wait. What are you doing? I'm going to go crazy. If I hear him, I'm going to go crazy. Stop this thing. Stop deceiving yourself. You're going to marry me. You're going to marry me. know that you're my daughter. I, I, I will put you behind the bars of DSS. No. Huh? <laughs> My daughter, oh, sorry, Her Excellency, Her Excellency, the first lady of the state. Yes, yes, I am my daughter. Oh, Bumu Ba for Molumunya Governor. <laughs> How is my son in law? Eh? Chai. Eh? Eh? <laughs> Chai. Oh, ma. Listen, in a question, Nago. Excellency Nidani Mambo. Excellency Nidani Mambo. Only a chimerous mother boy. Excellency in law. Uh, uh, nothing. <laughs> no, I, um, I'm just here drinking my beer and I'm getting ready for CWO meeting. Hey, my bad, my bad, my bad. Can't you see I'm on a call with a top government official? You know, I'm not Yeah. Sorry, my daughter. Sorry, my her ex. Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay, we'll talk later. Uh, bye. <laughs> bye. Mama Choba. Because stand up from here. What is it? What is it? What is it? Why? But why? Why have you forgotten so fast? Have you forgotten that my daughter is the incoming first lady of this state? Huh? You don't know my name again? And you're calling me Mama Choma? Mama I didn't know that your daughter is the first coming... Uh, sorry. Her answer is Sima. Her SLS man. Call me name. Her SLS man. Repeat Her SLS man. Like a siren. Her SLS man. Her SLS man. Her SLS man. Her you can sit down. Oh. Oh. Hey! Why are you doing okay? Okay, do. I'm not coming here. <laughs> this uh, one that you are taking a <laughs> bottle of beer. Do you need one? I need to. I need to pay more. I'm actually preparing for the CWO meeting. Okay. Um, okay, Chi! But then I want a bottle of beer. Hey, what? Hey. <laughs> Why are you the chef? I'm the fans. I answer that, Sima. I will, I, will, I, will, I will put your name in the people that will give mobilization. I answer that, Sima. You are blessed. I answer that, Sima. You are blessed. Oh! I'm Sima. Oh. Hey, what? Bring beer. What are you doing? Bring beer. Hey. Hey. Bring beer. Mama. Hey. Mama. 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 I was beginning to get worried. Eh? Were you able to meet your sister, John? I did not see her. I don't even understand today's market. No customers. Everywhere was so dry. I couldn't even finish myself. I had to give it to Mama, a former, to help me. It's okay, but you sold some. Mm, I tried. It's okay, just go to the kitchen and eat your food. I'm prepared to make an evening soup. Oh, thank okay. you. Hey, Mama, that reminds me. While I was coming back from the market, I walked through the palace. It is certain that Igwe is really dead, though. 
People were just walking in and out. My dear, he is a king. And his daddy is so sad. Everybody is sad in this village. Just let me not disturb you. Go and go to the kitchen and eat food. Let me go and get more leaves, okay? Okay, mama. Mm -hmm. Yes, that is it. In the early days of our marriage, this has been your father's tradition. Yeah. Staying together and drinking, making merry. Yes. So, toast. This is a toast to that. Unity, mm -hmm. love, yes. oneness and understanding. <laughs> Cheers. 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 You know, maybe becoming the next governor of the state will put this family on the political map. Oh. And that will span generations. Oh, <laughs> I'm so proud of you, my love. Mm, thank you, darling. Ah, <laughs> oh, no. Long live my king. It is well with you. <laughs> hey, Her Excellency. Do not forget to pay homage to the queen. Uh huh. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, my queen. Long live Her Majesty. <laughs> What's that? More Helens, help me. Baby. <laughs> help me. <laughs> oh, my God, King, you've got a crazy queen. <laughs> Mom, my hand is hanging, baby. Oh, okay. Do it. Long live your queen. Mom. Oh, the queen of the <laughs> kingdom. <laughs> 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 the one and only oh, Italian she... queen. Oh, <laughs> Tanya, you're so crazy. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Um, um, that was nice. <laughs> so, what next? Where do we go from here? That's what I'm about to say. The Onovo and the elders in council will have to be informed. They know the next step to take. You have a point, Mom. In that case, we have to summon them or... Sorry. Mm, it's time. My... No. Her Excellency mm -hmm. and myself have a social function to attend. Be careful. All right. Your Excellency. Mother, I'll keep you posted. No problem. Okay, Mom. <laughs> Always watch your husband's back. Yes. I will. That's and, not to, and not to worry, we will run the kingdom. Yeah, <laughs> while we attend to the affairs of the state. <laughs> <laughs> so, Mom, um... Yes, darling. Who's there? Come in. Hmm, Chioma. Sandra. You're here. To think that I've turned the whole house upside down looking for you. <laughs> so why is the house still standing? <laughs> well, beats me. <laughs> First lady. Please. Your excellency. Oh, please. <laughs> so can I come in? Sure. Ah. So baby girl. I came to find out what you are up to. What's your plans? My plans? Mm -hmm. Well, I have been thinking of the powers we will both control in a long time. Oh, Your husband, the governor, my husband, the king. Mm. <laughs> my darling, that's true. But first thing first, there has to be an election before we rule. <laughs> so that brings me to you. Let's talk about the one at hand. What are your plans for the coronation? Because I know you've got plans. You, you've got plans. <laughs> <laughs> she knows me too well. Ah, of course. You, you want to know what my plans are? Please shoot. Come with me. Uh huh. Follow me to my store. I see. Be my guest. I'm your guest. Are you blind? Didn't you see me? So, there is no respect again in this village. What have I done wrong to you this afternoon, Machoma? Ah, ah, you're asking me a question. Huh? 
ara ju ma juju ah mu ba fo mu lu won yin governor he said oh did you answer oh because i'm not with this court mother i am sorry huh? what is sorry huh? i don't need your sorry i will shock you and call the dss for you please I will uh, nature. Ma please. Match on my please. I will call. Don't this. call. Please. Hey, don't beg me. Please. Don't beg me. You're still calling me Machama. You're you don't know my name. You're still calling me Machama. Hold on. Her Excellency, please. Don't Her Excellency, I'm begging you. Don't call. Please. I am sorry. Forgive me. Forgive me. My, Her Excellency, please. I was not looking. Shut up! You're making noise. Her Excellency, please. No pim. Aha. Governor, Governor, how many people? Yes, and I am, I am, I am. In fact, in fact, it's okay. I will call back. It's like uh, she's begging. Okay. Listen. I'm sorry. Uh -uh. Don't sorry me. You can only be safe. Abone the lawyer. Call me now. Her Excellency. Again. Her Excellency. Man, man, because I'm not with escorts. He got all that escort name, but siren. You have to now be my siren. Pick this umbrella. Hey, it! And follow me. Be a good siren today. I'm one of them. I'm one of them. I'm one of them. I'm one of Go to my back! Her Excellency. My back! Her Excellency. And call me name. Her Excellency. Let's go. Her Excellency. Again. Her Excellency. Call me name. Her Excellency. Get out of me. Her Excellency. You are not calling me. Her Excellency, call my name. Her Excellency, I say call my name. Her Excellency, Her Excellency, Her Excellency, Her Excellency, Her Excellency, Her Excellency. My elders, I greet you all. Thank you, thank you. Yes. I converged this meeting because I have a very important announcement. Madam. I, Prince Harry Odwenyi, hereby cede the throne of my father to my younger brother here, Prince Victor Odwenyi. After all, he's also an Odwenyi. Ndiche, you heard him. Very well, sir. I know you. Hmm? But, Prince Harry, are you sincerely sure of what you have just said? We can still give you some time. In fact, a long time to think about it. And leave the throne empty for enemies to invade and usurp? No. Victor here is the new heir to the throne. You can go ahead and crown him. He has my support. Harry. Please, I will need you to reconsider your words. After all, you have more experience of kingship than I do. Prince Harry. That is my final decision. Victor. Yes. forever. <laughs> the Bowing Queen. Yeah. Mwon. Yeah. Where's Yeah. 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 Long live <laughs> my prince. Long live. Your majesty. Yeah, majesty. <laughs> <laughs> my people, you've seen it. You witnessed it. Now, let the preparation begin in earnest. And if there's any way you would need my help financially or otherwise, you trust our support. Ah! Oh no! <laughs> 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 
Welcome to another d edition of Showing Humanity. I am going to talk to you about something very important. A man, a young man full with grace and value. Not just that, a humanitarian here to serve in his village. Doing wonderful work. See, I don't want to say much, but I'm going to take you to him so we can get to know you better. Come along. Oh, okay. Yeah, good afternoon. Right. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. How are you doing? Fine, sir. All right, so like I said, the man of the moment. Let's get to hear more for him. Thank you. Okay, my name is um, Prince Harry. I am aspiring to be the governor of this very wonderful state of ours. Well, this is part of my daily routine. Um, I'm a homeboy. I'm a man of the people. So I fry akara. I do stuff like this. I do moi moi. I buy tap palm when I want to. It's, it's, it's not something unusual. Yeah. So even as governor, you'll still find me here trying to help her out, turn her akara balls, and uh, sometimes share to people. That's the essence of governorship. You lead by example. That's what I'm doing. Thank, Thank you so much. You're welcome. You, You're welcome. So you heard from the man himself, a humanitarian. Guess what? He said something I really enjoyed. He said, I'm a practical homeboy. So we are going to be seeing a lot of him when that time comes. Uh, have a nice day. We'll be right back. <laughs> Mm. This way you are dancing like someone who won a jackpot. My dear, I have won more than a jackpot. Standing right here before you is the next queen of Dumu Kingdom, Queen Sandra Oduin. Hey, <laughs> but wait, how come? I thought your husband was not the original heir. He wasn't all. But my dear, my family is becoming very powerful. The original heir, which is the incoming governor, has now ceded the throne to my loving husband. Hey! Congrats! Thank you! Listen, I'm going to take care of all their shabies that day. Hmm. On your business. Don't worry, when I become queen, you will get more than that. Oh yeah, tell me. Oh, are you majesty? Queen Sandra Odu Enyi, the Queen Mother, and where are you, Majesty, the incoming Queen? Ah, I won't bust you. Hey, where? This one, gang, gang. Hey, I'll go add, 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 add. Tell me more. The Royal Majesty. More. The Royal Majesty. Then we'll hear what? Queen Sandra Odu Enyi. Hey, are you, Majesty, the Queen Mother? Don't bring boss where they go say carry me. I don't think I can pass this place. This one, gang, gang. This one, gang, gang. Hey, hey, you majesty! Then we hear hey, what? Our only queen, the uh, incoming queen. Uh, hey, where? Uh, uh, hey, where you majesty? The queen mother, the incoming, I incoming. Come on, buddy. Who you want impress? Oh, oh. Mm. Coming down. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I believe that is settled already. Yes, I'll tell the whole words about seventeen words and them. Um... Oh, definitely. You yes. Yes. Okay, then I'll see you mm. My first lady. Mm -hmm. I'm good. Mm. Hold on, let me let me adjust you out. Okay. Because I want my husband to always look good and sharp before the press. <laughs> but you know your husband is good looking. Oh, that's true. Mm. I'm about the smartest man to accent that uh, exalted city. Yes, you are. <laughs> and you are also the most perfect for the seat. <laughs> Honey, I'm so proud of you. And I am sure the people of the state will be so grateful for the fresh air you give them. Yes, by God's grace. What is it? 
Mm. I just miss my father. I regret not having that last conversation with him before he died. I know. I understand. But don't worry. I'm sure wherever your daddy is, he is so proud of you. And there are more ways you can make him more proud of you. How? By making sure you win the election and immortalize his name. You sure have a way of bringing my mood back to normal. Mm -hmm, that's why I'm your angel. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on, you're making that. No, I mean it. <laughs> By the way, I was the one who introduced you to that joint. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, I still want to thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> Even though they were ripping me off. Hmm. Um, how is your brother coronation coming up? <sighs> well, coming up well. Um, the Duno Kingdom is full of excitement and um, the first stage has begun. Okay. So I hope you've sent your measurement to the royal designer. Oh yes, I did a long time ago. You know, I'm so ready to rock mm. a room <laughs> and who do we after party? Um, I don't know yet. I haven't seen the program for the event yet, so really? Mm. Okay. <laughs> okay, pass the bottle of wine. Oh, take it easy, do not go just celebrate it. Okay, let's start. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Mm. Okay. I'm going Mr. Chairman, I say keep your greetings to yourself. I cannot sit back and watch you people continue with this injustice. You want to steal my mandate and I will never allow it to happen. I don't understand. The, the primaries was open by law system. And Prince Harry won it. Free and it was clear. That is a lie. You know you're lying. Let me tell you. My legal team are not resting on their oars to restore my mandate back to me. Honorable Ndubisi, you must exhaust all avenue to reconcile this matter before taking it to court. Nonsense. Arrant nonsense, Mr. Chairman. Let me tell you, just get ready to dance in the court because you've not seen the last of this. If that's how you want it, then so be it. Oh, come on, Harry. You promised to be present for the ceremony. I was looking forward to your support. Oh, yeah. Well, I understand. But everyone was looking forward to seeing you. It would be bad to have an incoming government as my guest. It's all right. It's all right. Oh yes, uh, oh, I think she's here. She's there. Right, I'll talk to you soon. Hey! Oh, baby! Oh, baby! 
Open up, 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 open When the eagle brushes his feet against the ground, it has agar come to carry food to the trees or to pay homage to the ancestors. Prince Victor, the gods have spoken. The gods of Duru Kingdom have spoken. You will stand here and tell us when you think or where you feel very Coming to be crowned the king of Dulu Kingdom. In the next eight market days, mm. great one. Hey! Miigwe. May you reign forever. And so shall it be. You may need them. And so shall it be. Just off the phone with the presidency, and I never knew Mr. Ndubisi would we'll go this extent. Mr. Chairman, what are you saying? I mean, what do you mean? He won the party's congress. Why must you allow such a thing to happen? Wait, is this a joke or something? Do you know how much I worked? I worked through the words. To secure all those votes. Do you know that? I'm aware. Then extend the same to those voters at the National Secretariat. Tell them this is my mandate. See, the presidency is aware of this development. Even our governor. Being our party leader and still have the upper power. He has even invited you to the presidential lodge so we can discuss this at length. Listen to me. Like I told you and the party officers earlier, I worked very hard for this mandate. And nobody, nobody can take what belongs to me. Mark my words. Mr. Chairman, this is very, very unfair. Very, very unfair. We are heading to the court. You hear from us. Never have trusted the party chairman. Do you know he connived with those people to betray me? <sighs> These people will always betray you. Even your own family, top models, politicians. It's all right. So, well, what do you want to do? 
I'm appealing the judgment. My mandate cannot be stolen in broad daylight. Mm -hmm. Not while I'm alive. Do we still have trust in the judiciary? Honey, you see. Do you see why you shouldn't make decisions in a haste? I mean, you were so quick to give out the throne to your brother, knowing full well that you don't have the governor's seat at hand. Please. Now we don't have the governor's seat, we don't have a throne. Can you leave my brother out of this place, please? Oh, fine. I might as well leave you. Better than the one you brought to the palace. Yes, now. Nah. But I told you to wait for my new shipment to arrive. <laughs> I like it. Okay. Mm. Sister, I think I like this one and this one. Mm. Yes. To look good on Mama. With that um, greyish gele. Mm. Okay. That means I'll take this one for Mama and myself. But you have to get another one for her. She can't wear the same uniform with Mama. Okay. Like this, that one over there. You like it? Sister, why can't I wear this thing with Mama? I want to wear this same outfit with her. Come on now. See, Mama has a special place on that day. Don't worry. Next or Fala, you wear the same uniform with Mama. Okay? Or you calculate my money for me. Okay, my royal majesty. Huh. <laughs> See how she's hailing me. Yes, hey, wash me and finish all my money. Sister, because you should move. My friend, drop this, this thing. I've spent okay. a lot already. My Excellency, you need to see how the old relations are buying for me. Her Excellency, this, her Excellency, that. When I went to the market, you see gifts. They were calling me. Give your daughter this, give your daughter. You know, Mama, Mama, Kanye. She changed your napkin when you were little. She gave me something for you. Even Mama Uchu gave me your wife. Oh, what a hope. Very chido. Also, go. Mere and Siri. What nonsense is that? Are you mad? How many times have I warned you not to, not to use your teeth and open drink for anybody in this house? Don't we have cup opener? My friend, drop that nonsense and go and get opener and get out of here. Okay, Mama, wait, wait. This boy, this boy does not listen to anything I say. Let's let it see. What, what it has to do with it? Oh, man. You have not made your rights. Please calm down. I've warned himself that time. Ma, calm down. Umpire is involved. <laughs> it's for me now. Nah. I'm here. 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 I'm very, very fine. Thank God I left earlier. <laughs> I left earlier. Uh, thank you. So, about the governorship, you know, my daughter. Your face is not that bright, though. Huh? Is everything okay? I hope you will not make this kind of face when you move into the government house. <laughs> my God gave me here. Her <laughs> Excellency, eh? Sometimes he, he didn't look at the night as if you still know what is uh, what is on board. <laughs> what do we talk about if not the Kamadashi? We talk about the village, the people, your health. And they settle you in before we have all this kind of discussion. Eh? <laughs> hey, my daughter, her excellency, sometimes like this, if you're talking about the accent, what was the confess lady in Ebu? Is it settling, settling in? <laughs> I know that I came from Afa, but I am not tired. As long as the governorship is uh, uh, on board, as long as my son in law is the governor, as long as you are. 
please. Can you no pause? Let's talk about something else. <laughs> they leave governorship. Samuel! Samuel! Mama, what? <coughs> Mama. My Lord, that go. That's one more thing I want to ask you. Sorry, let me belch like excellency. My daughter, please then. Eh? I am your mother. And you know the love I have for you is too much. Please, when you enter the government house, make sure that my room, my room is very close, as in. Mama. Very close mama, to your mama. own. Mama. Mama. Go drink. Drink, we'll talk about it later. Eh? Drink, then you'll be last. Remove your scarf first. So eh. you breathe. Eh? So at this, my dear, I will enter. Eh, eh. My dear, I don't even know this. Uh... This one for original account. When I've got number. As Excellency, now I have to be taking things that have uh -huh. that number. Oh, okay. Hey, Harry. Hmm. What do you intend to do now? Because I know how much money you've thrown into that Congress. This is a major setback. Yeah, but we have filed an appeal. I'm not going to sit back and watch anybody steal what belongs to me. I'm going to reclaim my mandate. Are you sure this is going to pull through? Because the elections are around the corner. Not to worry, bro. I'm sure we'll win at the appeals. Enough of politics. How is the coronation coming up? How is the preparations? Oh, I thought you'd never ask. Well, everything is going as planned. As a matter of fact, I've never seen a united force amongst the clans that make up the Dunu Kingdom. Hmm, that's impressive. <laughs> that's what I told you. Everything will go on fine. Dunu will be so proud to have you as king. <laughs> and of course, the state will be proud to have you as their excellency, our governor. <laughs> Your highness. <laughs> My excellency. <laughs> I'm loyal. <laughs> All right, bro. I'll see you when I'm back. Oh, okay. Very well. Very well. All right, bro. You're safe, bro. Yeah. You know, now I see why people go on long holidays after elaborate occasions. One could go berserk trying to organize an event. But I thought the women were helping out. Besides, you we were them in the last meeting. So how did it go? It went well. They were very supportive. You know, those that took part in the last coronation were on ground to give their two cover advice. But above all, they were helpful. <laughs> well, my love, I'm glad you're learning very fast. But don't forget to brief mother. Of course, you know she's um, experienced in things like this. That reminds me. Where is she? I have lots of G's to tell her. I'm very sure you know your way upstairs, darling. Huh? All right. I'll see you shortly. <laughs> oh. I'll be with you soon, huh? Okay, darling. You promised I would win the appeal. But I'm not to be blamed for this. We had all evidence to back up our claims that there was indeed a conclusive primary election. And Mr. President, we promised to pressure that dumb head to step down. See, there's still light at the end of the tunnel. Your Excellency, our legal team have promised to approach the Supreme Court, so we can't just give up so soon. The audacity of both. Mr. Chairman, do you realize the elections is in a couple of weeks? That I'm aware. But I will advise you don't get fret over this. I believe everything is going to be alright. Everything is not going to be alright. I worked so hard to get this mandate. And I'm reliably informed that some members of the party are working to see me lose in connivance with you. Prince Harry! Have a nice day, Mr. Chairman. Just imagine. How you just accuse me of this? Hello? How could he allow a thing like that to happen? How can we lose the appeal few weeks to the general elections? 
calm down, my friends. I think we can still find a way around this. Don't ask me to calm down! I had my reservations about that lawyer, remember? But you kept assuring me that he was competent. Now look at it. We have lost the appeal, we have lost everything. No, my prince. Greetings, my prince. Like I was saying, there is still light at the end of the tunnel. Oh, yes. You me. Oh, listen. The Supreme Court can still give us back our mandate. Don't be funny. Anyways. Uh, friend. <laughs> if I'm to say you did not lose anything, I mean, you still have the throne. Why not go and take it back? What did you say? The throne of your fathers. Go and take it back. You know, my wife actually said something like that, but hey, that's not possible. I already ceded that throne to my younger brother. And he's been prepared. How do you think I'll go back and ask him to give me the throne? Why not? Moreover, his coronation has been fixed. Oh, stop that. You are the heir apparent. Are you not? See, friend, losing in both ways will not go down well in the press. Yes, there are reports will nail your political career permanently on a dead tree. Think about that. Think, silly. So you are asking me to take back the throne from my younger brother? After letting him go through the preparations and... Do you think he'll accept it? What other choice? You ceded it to him. So, you have every right to ask for it. Listen, friend. This is the time for you to make a mark. Yes. Remember, that when one door of happiness closes, another opens. Oftentimes, we spend a lot of time looking at the closed door that we fail to realize the open one. Think about it, friend. Think about it. Yeah. Why we wait the, 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 the Supreme Court's judgment? These fabrics are very beautiful. Now, this. Can't remember ordering this one. Sandra. Come what body for my matter. Mm -hmm. You see, when it comes to materials, mm -hmm. I be chair lady. And that is why I brought her over. So you guys can make your selection. You know, we all need to be very colorful on that day. <laughs> Sandra. Sandra will always be Sandra. <laughs> Which one you they touch me? No, they do this kind of thing with me. I know what I'm talking about. I said, we all need to be colorful on that day. Sorry. And that is why she's here. <laughs> oh, I brought this one for the royal servant. Okay. I think they need to change from their normal look that day. Trust me, Her Majesty is going to give this palace a new look. Oh, that was thoughtful of you, my dear. Thank you. Oh. You're welcome. <laughs> That's good. I mean, the designs are breathtaking. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> so, ladies, which color are we choosing? <laughs> Queen Mother, Queen Mother, Queen Mother, Queen Mother. <laughs> 
Queen Maka. You know, say, if one king come out, another king go take over. As the incoming queen of this great kingdom, I would like you to make your choice. <clears throat> My daughter, I am getting old. I might be colorblind. You're not. Please, Chioma, I would want you to choose for us. Trust me. Anyone you pick, I will accept the verdict. Mother, you mean me? Chioma, you, of course. Oh. Mother, thank you for the honor. You're welcome. <laughs> okay. Hi. Let's oh. see what we have here. Okay, these are for the meats, like you said. Yes. Not bad. Like we have always done in the past. Usul clan redeemed their pledge of two cows. Hmm. They also promised to be duly represented that day. I hope you have extended invitation to other kingdoms, especially Umuduli. Yes, um, yes no. They too have pledged their total support That's right. to the new king. Huh? Um, each of them also donated two cows wow. and, and uh, promised. To bring other items. Yes. Yeah. 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 Greetings, <laughs> brother. <laughs> What a surprise! Ah. Your Excellency! Your Excellency! Yeah, My on. governor! Welcome, Your Excellency! Your Excellency! Why did you get back? Your Excellency! My governor! My governor! Your governor! I have come to announce that I am here to reclaim my throne. Harry! How is that even possible? You said you were not interested in becoming king of Dunu Kingdom. And as you can see, I am interested. But we all know that you are the next governor of the state. <laughs> Keep that aside, Ono. We all also know that I am naturally the heir to this throne in question. It is my birthright. So I have come to demand my staff of authority. Hmm. Ah. Prince Harry, you are joking. I say you are joking. We don't do things like this. Here. Oh, oh. We have tradition. Yes. Eh? You better retrieve your steps. Or else. <laughs> my staff. Is he not? No. He must be some kind of drugs. I don't understand. Why will he come back to take back a throne he already said that to you? It took a while for his words to digest. I mean, how? You're not giving up that throne. Do you understand? 
Harry will have to kill me first before he can get close to that throne. What exactly. Says? Same thing I told him. He wants to make us a laughing stock before the kingdom. And he has failed. He has failed woefully. And I know that his useless wife put him up to this. We never forced him to cede the throne to us. He gave us willingly and we are keeping it. And that's on period. Of course. I did not ask for this. I did not beg for this. The throne is mine and mine to keep. Do not worry, I will not give up my darling. I will not. Who could have pushed Harry to come up with such a decision at a time like this? Huh. I wonder. Mother, can you at least um, continue trying him? Let's find out from him for sure. Can't you see I've been trying his line? And it has not been connecting. Harry should know that any bad decision he takes now is capable of destroying this family. Let me call Chioma. I've already tried her number, it's not reachable. Mother, what are we going to do? All we will do is to stop him from destroying the happiness of this family that took your father years to build. Huh. And Victor, have you managed to reach him? You should have seen how furious he was. What are we going to do? I know what to do. What are you going to do? Harry. Did you say you want to take back your throne? Yes, Mama. Who gave you that kind of idea? Because it's my right to the king. Exactly. I mean, we gave up the throne in the first place because of uh, the governorship position. But since that one didn't work, it's right to give back what belongs to us. King of where? I'm asking. King of where? Don't tell me, don't have a that you want to lead a whole governorship. Governor! And go for King of Bush. King of Juno Kingdom, Mama. Harry. Choma. Oh. I'm a pretty me. Oh. Hey, they said they were. I was a liar. I'm a Hey, 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 hey! Ma, what is it? Why are you crying? Oh, 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 oh! Hey! 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 Cherene, Cherene, it's it. Mama, hold on, wait. Are you actually crying? Choma, Choma, Ken. Oh, Gini. Choma, um. Have you forgotten that? That they call me Afo Moro Wengofo. Choba, have you forgotten that they call me Her Excellency? Chai, 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 chai. Mama, why are you talking like this? And they had it. Whether you like it or not, you must be governor. It is not our making. INEC decides who becomes governor. It's the voters that count. INEC? Who is INEC? Give me his or her number. Let me give me a call. Let me give them call. Whoever they are, I must call them. Give me their numbers. Mama, like it is all the same thing. Nothing has changed. I mean, we're still in the power position of authority. Eh? <laughs> If you don't want me to go, tell me, let me carry my bag and go. Mama, you are beginning to cry more than you believe, though. Oh. I was the one deprived of that position. I don't know why you're taking it this far. Breaking my heart is not the best. Can you even keep her head silent? Oh, Let them keep calling you her head Oh, oh yeah, yeah, it's the same thing. Oh, yeah, 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 oh, ye
I do not have water in my mouth while talking. Have you forgotten that throne belongs to me? I am the crown prince, and that throne is mine by birth. Yes, and you categorically give up your right without considering the consequences, the risk involved. I want my throne back. Why are we even discussing this? That throne is mine, has always been. Why are we making a mountain out of a molehill? Because you stated it, and I will inform the council that I'm ready to ascend the throne and willing to compensate you all for whatever inconvenience this turnaround has cost. I'm on the quest for power. not to be a clock in the wheel of progress. Warn him! And what is that supposed to be? You know exactly what I mean, bitch! Your husband was never interested in that throne. Few days to our coronation, he barges into our house requesting for the throne. Who does that? Well, mad dog, you know quite well that this throne we're talking about belongs to my husband. He is the rightful heir to it. So it is absolutely normal for the owner of something to want it back. After all, he gave it to your husband to hold on to for him when he's ready. Now he's ready and he needs it. I see. Yes. So you have been the one behind his actions? You've been the one feeding him those lies? <laughs> really? <laughs> well, from your action, it's very clear to me that you are delusional. Now I need you to carry your crazy ass self out of my compound. Get out. Wait. Excuse you. Who are you talking to me? You. I should leave where? Leave my house. My comp. You call this Caton a house? No wonder. I see. You're no longer comfortable in this Caton. That is why you told your husband to come and get the throne so you both can come and live in a mansion. But guess what? You will remain in this Caton forever. So get out of my house. You will not come to my house and insult me. So get your crazy ass self into your box and drive out of my compound. You're not silly, stupid. Did you just slap me? And I will do it again if you don't behave yourself now. Get the hell out of my house. You're stupid. You're mad. Don't you ever lay your filthy, dirty hands on me again. In my own house? Yes. You just... <laughs> How about you to that? Me? Mother, it's entirely her fault. Since my husband was presented as crown prince, Choma has been grumbling and displaying utter wickedness everywhere. Cheap liar. What then did you go to do in her house? What else can I possibly be doing in her house? For Christ's sakes, Chioma is my co-wife. Besides, my husband will be crowned king soonest. It's only normal I extend a hand of friendship to her. Enough. Please, everybody settle down. There's no need quarreling. Remember, to have a successful coronation ceremony of victor here, the entire family has to be united. I am the true king, and I will be the one to be coronated. Well, unfortunately, I am the chosen king. Already presented to the Imobi as the heir. What are you talking about? And that's on period. You, the first son, 
succeeded the throne to my husband peacefully. Nobody forced you. Now you're bringing war. Oh, get ready. Because I will save you that war wholeheartedly. What is wrong with this girl? People should calm down. Let's handle this thing amicably. People no no. Mommy, talk to him. Talk to him. You talk to him. What is his problem? Talk to him, mommy. Talk to him. He's the one you should talk to. You can now point at me and talk. What do you mean by that? You have a look in your Hi. Hi, Shimo. Eh? Ngwa now. Ino chakam na kagi. Ima na api. Abagogi. It is obvious. Why is this boy? This thing. Why is he so invested in something that is naturally not his? Now, okay. Why are you calling a boy? You. I am a man. You. Man. Not a boy. To man. Don't try to intimidate me, my boy. Why are you invested in this? Don't try to intimidate me. Are I am the first son of this family. Don't you give me my dad. You gave it to me. Oh, we need to keep You gave it to me. You have only one for. Ah, it's okay. Come and be king and let me see. Move. Stop. 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 Are you sure this palace will contain us today? If it doesn't, we sleep outside. But wait, why does Prince Harry want to be the king? Does he want to be a governor and king at the same time? Anything is possible. A greedy man may want to be upstairs and downstairs. The elders better intervene. If not, blood will flow. Shut up, Biko, whose blood will flow. You will want to a rule of open. One person must succumb. Prince Harry or Prince Victor. I prefer to watch and see. Hey, well, somebody's gone. This is a bad idea. She will end up destroying our family. Who cares? I don't give a hoot what happens. Okay? There will be no peace in this family until what belongs to me is returned to me. But I think about mother. Who cares? Shona, please try and talk to him. He understands you. Since he already gave the throne to Victor, let the sleeping dog lie. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. My dear Ade, what sleeping dog? See, your own dog can decide to lie down. That is on you. But I won't spend so much money on a dog for it to lie down and not be active. Do you understand? Hold on a minute. Now I get it. Oh, would you saw all this while you've been planning with Sandra? Planning with her to take over the throne from my husband. So she will be the queen while I come lick her shoes. Hey, ah! I think you're going to take over from You can leave. Exactly. What? Yes. Since you have decided to be on Victor's side, knowing fully well that I'm the first son of this family and it's my right to be king. But you have chosen to be on the wrong side. What are you doing in my house? What exactly are you doing on my sitting on my chair? Brother Harry, what has come over you? Yeah. I am asking you to not let your ambition destroy our family. Eh, please hold it there, motivational speaker. See, your audience are not here. They are outside. So my darling sister-in-law, please get your ass off my seat and go outside and motivate your fools. Get out! <laughs> Joy! Eh, eh, don't call my name, oh. Tell me the issue. I won't put my mouth in front of brother and sister's fight. You two should take me your fight there. No sense, dear. What's in, brother? Can you imagine? This time, dear. Can you imagine? That's how you plan. You plan everything. If I don't get back my throne, there will be no peace in this. That's the spirit. That is the spirit. There will be no peace in, in the kingdom.
Sorry, eh? Now that place I'll be there for my duty post in uh, my office. I hear a guy the talk say you should come, I'll be going. Um, and you know, I don't want to lose my job. Now here for the feed family, no work for the country. Make it not go be like say you put sand for my garden because me too, I not go agree. I think you should come, I'll be going. Your time is up, man. A, a, a point of correction, ma. Please, can you come and enter your car? Let me open the gate wide so that you can come and be going for real. Are you insane? Have you gone mad? Are you talking to me? Madam. You know, me and you there now, so I'm I am talking to you. Madam, I beg. I know they chop banana. I prefer bole. And if I'm insane, you feel not like me because I'll be any other person. Please, madam, with all due lesser respect, come and be going, man. Your time is up. Over and out. What did you say to me? <coughs> Madam, I once read you the talk, but I can still repeat myself again. Come and be going. Let me open gate for you and, and get out of my uh, my house. Uh, uh, I should come and be going. Yes, Madam. And get out of your gas house. Immediately effect, ma. Kindly repeat what you said. Unto repeat, madam, please come and get out of my ogre house. Are you mad? Have you got bananas? Do you know who you're talking to? Look at this fool. I don't blame you. I come to talk to my brother. I get thrown out. I come out here and I meet this fool. Madam, I am not insane. And if I mean say you not go like me, madam, I feel wrong enter you, madam. I beg, with all due and lesser respect, for the last time, can you please get out? Your Are you still talking? Leave my presence now. Eh? I said, leave my presence now. To open the gate so that you can. I said, leave my presence now. Hey, imagine Chioma. I told you that that woman is a chameleon. She has nothing uninterested all this while, not knowing she's a clog in the wheel of progress. Fanning the flames of discord. I told you that day, I have reservations about her. You said it too, but I was too carried away to listen to you. But you see that throne? She will not have it. My husband must be crowned king. Yes, but not for mouth. How do you mean? I mean, Chioma's arms are not folded at the moment. She must be planning on how to destroy you and your husband. But wait, Sandra. So you want to fight with bare hands? Uh, before Uncle, what did you think I was going to use to fight her? Would I even fight first round? See, if you enter my car, there's no kind of weapon you will not find in there. There's cutlass, there's razor blade, there's hole, there's scissors, any kind of weapon. The only weapon that is not in that car is Axid. And that is because I have not found it yet. If I find Axid, I will include it amongst the weapons. Then you have to change the tide of the game. If you want to win the fight, listen, I'm going to show you the best way to win a fight. The best way to win whatever that is rightfully yours. Okay? Bia, I don't understand the angle where they talk from. What do they play? Listen, I have told you before, if you want to talk to me, talk to me. Don't meander through the corners. Talk to me. Okay. What is the... Okay, okay calm down. Calm mm. down. Let me tell you. 
She thinks they can just they can just come from nowhere and take over the throne. Just like that, we'll hand it over to her husband. I swear, I wish I can just pluck out that girl's eyes. Yes, calm down. Come I wish I can pluck it out and give it to her to, to, to chew. But wait, calm down, Choma. You see, the devil is at work. I can feel it, I can see it. Exactly. Our enemies are at work. Mm -hmm. And all we need is to pray. She can be calm with each other. Ah, can you imagine something we gave somebody to hold on to? When we come back, we we'll take it. Which is okay. Which is one, let us pray. Prayer is the key. Jesus started with prayer and ended with prayer. I have been in the chinek. Yan, there only one chinek on your premier in less than days. I'm a mama, see, I'm a one at you. God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. Yes, Lord. Father, we are now in your presence to present our problem. Yes. And our problems are different. Yes. I know my problem is different from my daughter's problem. Yes, but God, my prayer at this moment is that you use my own prayer request to bless my daughter. She knows nothing. God, that is why I am bringing this, our problem, to your presence. God, please, I pray that you help my son-in-law. My own son-in-law Harry to become the governor of this state, Because I know that you, that is my God, oh Lord, shall promote him from governorship to senator, from senator to vice president, Mama. from vice president to the president of Mama. the country, from president to prime Mama. minister. Mama, that is not what we are praying now. We're praying for him to take over the throne. We've lost the chance of being governor. Gago. I know, Choma, come down, I'm coming to that. We are still praying, God is here. God is present here. Oh. If you want to give me time, let's continue. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to say, because I'm going to say, I'm interruption. When I'm going to say, I'm going to say, I'm Prime Minister. He will put God, my son in love from Prime Minister to the leader of the world. So I wish I'd be the conqueror, like you said in your world. Chineke, if you can, my you're going to put me here in the Biko. Do not allow anybody to take away this name that you have given me. Chineke, the name of excellency shall remain in my family. The name of first lady shall remain in my family. The name of governor shall remain in my family. Chineke, Mama. When are you getting my Biko? He can't be like God. 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 He can't be like let that person die by fire! Die by fire! Die by fire! 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 In the name of Jesus. God, I know you have heard my prayer. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Jesus. Amen. Chi? Choma. Uh-uh. Choma! Choma! Who are you? And what have you come here to do? Oh, um, my name is Neka. I'm Sandra's younger sister. She called me to come and see her. I see. So it's the two of you that has been conspiring to bring down this palace. Hmm? No, 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 no. I Trying think it... to take what belongs to me, right? No, I think you're mistaking me for someone else. I said I'm Sandra's younger sister. I have amnesia now, right? And if you are, what's her name? The mad dog sister, I should now fly away because you're her sister. Guards! Take this trash out of this compound. Uh, Olivia, what's my. She's Sandra's younger sister. She's what? She's Sandra. Hey! Are you. That guy boy, boy, Will you not you know what you tell me about will sound Where Sorry. the hell are you going to, young lady? Evan, move. Do you need me to no, teach, teach you your job? Get this thing out of this compound. Me. Mama, you know, this is totally unfair. No, let her talk. No, 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 let her talk. Let me hear you, young lady. What were you saying? This is not fair. Oh. I mean, my sister has as much right as you in this yeah, palace. Yeah, 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 just lift her up out of this compound, nonsense! Sharp mouth like her sister. Mama Joma! Mama Joma! Mama Joma! Please! 
this wicked woman. Mama Choma! Who is shouting? I can hear a dog barking. Mama Choma, so I am now a dog. Your house will soon be on fire, Mama Choma. Why your daughter want her to stay away from my daughter? How dare she save my daughter out of the palace? Eh? On to what level? On to what level now? Calm down. Which of my daughter are you talking about? Oh, how many of them do you have? Chama, of course. Tell her to stay away from my daughter. She should stay away from my daughter. Oh. No, it can't be. I know that you are not in line with political affairs. It is my duty as the woman leader to put you on line. Awesome. Yes, to tell you the end thing. Number one, my daughter is the incoming first lady of the state. She doesn't have time. She's a busy woman. She's, she is busy with political affairs. Yes. So that's not how she will have time for your daughter. Your daughter. Your daughter is among those that are giving mobilization. Oh, shut up. Shut up. Just warn her. Warn her. Tell her to stay away from my daughter. Else. <laughs> now if she try me. Oh, I'm a man. If she tries me again. Oh, I'm eh. <laughs> hey. Madam. Neko. In political system, that's how we treat people. And I think it is my duty to host you. So, I want you to choose breakfast, lunch, dinner, banquet. One more banquet. Me, don't wait. Me, breakfast. Chuku po kwa go kube. Bom, I'm bored and I'm wanting to get here. I think you, you, I think you need, you need DSS to visit. You need the DSS, madam. I will send you the DSS. You need to sleep in the cell at least for for eight hours. To calm your head. Rubbish. Clap trap. Don't get yourself into trouble. Do you know you can be arrested for impersonation? Your daughter is not the first lady. Stop this nonsense you're doing. Do you know that as I am claiming this seat, very soon you will go to the government house? Eh? First lady. Billy, I am your mother. Mama, we are not moving into the government house. My husband is no longer vying for the governor's, governor's seat. Eh? Mama, my husband is going to be the king of the kingdom. That's what you should be aiming at. Ah. Which king? What kind of king? Uh, uh, listen, uh, listen, listen. My daughter, your husband cannot be a king. He is bigger than a king. Your husband is the incoming governor of the state my son-in-law is the governor of the state in fact huh? please uh, 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 you don't just say that if, uh, he cannot be a king god no god forbid mama but, 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 do, do, do you know you're indirectly praying for my husband's downfall ah stop this now you're supposed to be on our side not against us listen my daughter i cannot pray for my for for my own my own son-in-law's downfall I cannot pray for His Excellency's downfall. What I am talking about is that when it comes to the sight of being a king, no, 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 I am not there. But for the sight of the governor of the state, I am fully with you. In fact, your husband is the governor of this state. It is already confirmed. Mama, Vico, Mama, see, I'll call you back in time. I'm busy now. Okay, 
mother, my mother is answering call now. Are you tired? Oh, uh, so bad draw, but I know that I am a mother excellency. Yes, I am mother excellency. I am her excellency. Okichi, okay, were you actually at home? Where your mom left at the market today? I was at home now. God. If you see the way people were talking at your like talking about your mom, laughing, I was even ashamed of being your friend. Just let me come and tell you. Ito, you left your house to come here and insult me. No, no. Just I saw the thing. The thing was so embarrassing. See how people were laughing. The worst part of it is that the way she raised her shoulder like this up. The next thing you, you, you hear is that she'll pick her phone. Yes! Ah, ah, is it yes, yes for me, God? If you see people were talking, oh, oh, they fear for? all the villagers are talking about oh, they fear for? my mother. What's that? I have tried. I have preached. I don't even know who gave her the idea to be dressed. <laughs> oh, Gechi. Mama. You are gossiping with your mother. No. I'm not, I'm not gossiping. She came to return the assignments that, that I gave her. That the devil gave you? Yes. The devil has given you assignment to be gossiping with your mother. But it's not like that though. Yeah, this thing must be from the village. They, 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 they must have sent this thing from your father's. No, okay, Auntie! Okay, Auntie! Okay, they didn't make a watch, Rodney! See this, see this man. This man say he wants to see you. I say no, Oga, go. Maga no wants to see anybody. He say he wants to see you. I say Oga, go. Maga no wants to see anybody. And I no more want to run. See where Colonel does. Ningo, Your Majesty, Your SLS. Lagos. Harry. 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 You see, you are my elder brother. So it will be so uncultured to be a daggers drawn with you over the throne. So I'm here to make a proposal. Allow me to be king and I promise you after my reign, your sons will continue your legacy. I come in peace. Mm. Mm -hmm. You come in peace. Are you done flexing your muscles? The last time we met, we were at Daggers Drawn. You willingly gave up the throne. I begged you to reconsider. But you insisted. Well, that was because I wanted to represent the family at the government level. I wanted to become governor. And you know what that would have done to this family. Or rather, would have done for this family. But now that that dream is lost, I want you to hand me back my throne and I will give you some of my inheritance. What? Yes. At least that way your future is secure. Now that sounds like a broad daylight scam. <laughs> Everything is not all right, you know. Isn't it obvious that I am a daggerhead with my brother? He is persuading me to give up the throne for him. And that is impossible. You have already been presented to the Imobi. 
and two heirs cannot be presented at the same time except another family which you know it cannot be done this time then give the throne to another family my prince will you help me or no if my brother will not allow me to sit on our father's throne then you should give the throne to another family why the greed we have for power have a good day you know why are we chasing these ambitions Hatred growing in the blood becomes war. Brothers killing one another. Tell me why, oh why, oh why is our back against each other? Oh, oh no, over my dead body will I allow that to happen. Please, do not heed to whatever he tells you. He's just a child. Time compares us to hurry. Your Majesty. Oh, oh, no. I promise I'm going to look into it. You have been my husband's most confident and loyal friend. Thank you for bringing this to my notice. Thank you, Your Majesty. I'll be on my way. It's okay. Thank you. your brother. He wants to destroy all that your father labored for. How? What did he do? He wants to give up the throne. What? Victor, so after all your hassles and exposures, you want to give up the throne? Really? What will you have me do, my darling wife? Isn't it better I give it up so we all can have peace? By destroying all that your father has built? Ah, oh, Victor. I am so disappointed in you. How could you be this insensitive? You know when he mentioned it to me, I thought he was joking. Harry already ceded the throne to you. In a matter of days, you are going to be crowned king. <clears throat> um, Brother Victor, your wife is right. I understand you're under immense pressure not to be at crossroads with Brother Harry, but... We do not support you requesting another family to take the crown. Exactly my point. If you do not need the throne anymore, hand it back to your brother. Better still, sit up to your responsibilities. Excuse me. Good day, Mama. Oh, I mean, sorry. Good day, Mother Excellency. I, I came in respect of what I told you the other day. Uh, you mean you want my son-in-law, the governor, to help you get a job? Yes, Mama. So, sorry, I forgot. Yes, Mother Excellency. Try not to forget, young man. There are dear sirs on the fence watching. Oh yes, and even cameras watching us, so you better behave yourself. Okay, Mother Excellency, I understand. Ah, you have to go home. We'll make another appointment so that I will find out when it is right to see my son-in-law, the governor. Okay, no problem. I, I appreciate. Thank you very much, Mother Excellency. I'll be on to bow while saying that. Greet me like an excellency. Thank you very much, Mother Excellency. I appreciate it. Ah, you said you're a graduate, but you do not know how to greet excellencies. How? I'm sorry, Mom. Club trap. Don't you have uncles or a relative that can at least try to call them to order? They are mature. 
and should be able to caution themselves. I don't know why Harry suddenly woke up and decided to stare the hornet's nest. <sighs> Has it always been like this? Fighting, tearing each other apart? Your home must be a battleground for those two grown-ups. No. We've always been a close family. Just the way my father said it to me. Father, you know you are my hero. Yeah. And I will never do anything. In fact, we will never do anything to bring this record to your name. Of course. I hope so, because I've got my mother on home, my beauty and canna. Amen. <laughs> Mother, <laughs> my husband, I'm not sure. Anyway, there is something I want to show you. Okay, what's that? DK! DK! Yes, your honest. Go and get me, bro. Right away. Bro? I wonder. Dad, what do you want to do with the broom? Just wait. Hmm? Where are you? My king, what for? Maybe we have to sweep the whole compound. <laughs> Since <laughs> when? <laughs> <laughs> well, um, you hold this. Hey, Daddy has done the magician. <laughs> you hold this. Ancient magic. Ancient magic. <laughs> African magic. I like that. Take this. Are you their mother? Take this. Oh, oh it's not a game. See? Can you break it? Just break it. Like, break it. Again. Yes. Uh, I've done that already. No, no, no. I'll split it in different forms. No, no, just just one. Look at okay. it. Okay, look at it. Throw yeah. one away. Mm -hmm. Okay, can all of them be the same? No, no it's broken. Okay, you break this into two. Ha! Ah, that, that this one is hard work. I can't break a bunch of them. How possible is it to break this together? <laughs> huh? My husband, I, I don't understand. Mm. What my two brothers cannot do. Maybe you can do better. Daddy, what are you up to? <laughs> yes, um, you see, nobody can break this. Unity is what? Strength. I don't want you people to allow outsiders to come in between you. There's a saying in our place, and your command million or wow for food. When we all urinate in one place, it will form. Good form and good smelling. One day, Kabafa Madu. My blood is on all of you. I'm not blood of separation. I told you, me no. I don't want to hear that tomorrow one of you has gone to court to challenge the brother. Unekwanaka Wunyuno come in between your people. Don't let your wife to come in between your people. I have no other child or I have no children outside. I don't even have a concubine. Your mother can attest. I did not have anybody that has any child for me outside. Because if I hear any of you has gone separate ways with the brother, I will cause the person, cause the person from beyond. Don't say I did not tell you. And you come on me alone or Megini. Please don't let anybody come in between your people. Did I make myself clear? Yes, yes father. father. Yes, yes father. father. So not tomorrow. My wife will say, hey, uh -huh. that, that's why your brother is cheating you. Or your, 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 your brother is taking it. We are not. Yes, father. Wherever I am. Don't say I did not. I met you, Mamu. I just let you know my name. Oh, 
It's okay. I think you need a fresh meal. Let's take a walk. Hmm? <laughs> Power is intoxicating. It blinds your reasoning so much that you can never differentiate a friend from a brother. Hmm? Hmm. Like they always say, there is light at the end of the tunnel. Just as I hope they don't turn up dead before hitting the light. Hmm? It's okay. My princess, you sent for us. Yes, I did. Um, prepare vegetable salad and uh, rice for my friend and I. I'll be back in 30 minutes. Okay, my princess. You. Yeah. Hello. Hello. Oh no, thank you. Thank you very much. Um, that's not yes. Yes, I'm not going to go I don't know. I I don't know. I don't know. I I you don't be right on over there. Thank you. You don't look higher for friends. Oh, oh. Greetings, my elders. Welcome. Crown Prince Victor. Oh no, I would rather you corrected yourself on that introduction. I am the crown prince here. God ordained crown prince. Too hard for you to swallow, huh? I am the heir to the throne. And no matter the amount of your childish intimidations and oppression, you cannot stop the chosen one. I am the chosen one. No, you are not. I'd rather you see Houston. Enough! That's enough, both of you. Excuse me, excuse me. Please, sit down. Let us discuss why we are here. Thank you very much, my elders. Listen, both of you. We convinced this meeting here to avoid any interruption from anywhere or any corner. Both of you sort of behaving maturely. You are here quarreling like bitter housewives. Oh. Ah. <clears throat> Thank you, Mr. Mbabi. Thank you, Lord. We invited the both of you here to find a lasting solution and lay to rest this long bickering over the crown and the throne. Your father, King Godwin, was an upright man who always paid detailed attention to every issue brought before him. Why are you good? Oh no, cut the chase and declare me king. Well, unfortunately, you cannot undo what has been done. Enough! I said enough, both of you. Okay. Oh no, this is what we will do. The coronation should be postponed for the next month. The royal family should go and put her house in order. And when we reconvene, we will know the rightful heir to the truth. 
But, uh, Prince Harry, you must understand that once an heir is presented before him will be, there is no going back. At all. No going back. Never. <laughs> well, at this point, my elders, I think I shall take my leave. I'll see you also. Thank you. Victor. No matter how long it takes, I am going to be made king. Oh, Harry. You know, I used to hold you in high esteem, but now I'm beginning to have a rethink. No wonder you lost the elections. Your lack of integrity is beginning to speak fully. Do have a good day. Me, Harry, Harry, I am warning you. Get out the way for me. Let's see who lasts last. Please, go. Harry, I will bash this car now. Bash the car. Bash it if you can. Harry, I said, bash this car now. I said, no, 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 you can. I said, I said, I said, no, 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 Go forward, make me shout. Oh, I'll, 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 Over the phone. I mean, are you saying just like that with, we've lost the phone? Yes. So many blah blah blahs. Those elders are very stubborn. Uh, but is this nothing you can do? I mean, is there no gods, I mean, a peace, sacrifice, or whatever tradition they have to do to give it back to you? Better still, you, you bribe those old men. Oh no, who and those men cannot be bribed. They are willing to sacrifice their lives to save this tradition. Honey, are you saying just like that we are losing the throne? I said there is uh, something else we can do. This does not make sense to me. It makes no sense. I mean, you were the one that gave it, handed it over to him. 
You can as well say give it back to me. Does it not work that way? What's going on here? You can just lose both sides. You, you, you lose the governorship seat and then lose the throne. Honey, come on. Let's, let's, let's do something to this. Kingsley, my prince, are you sure about this? Hundred percent sure. My prince, you wanted another way. This is it. Believe me. You're telling me this lonely place holds the thing that I search? My prince, why do you always underestimate me? I have brought so many of my wealthy and influential friends to this place. Like who and who? Okay, I will tell you only one. The Senate President. Yes, mm. of course. See, my prince, there are places on earth where ordinary men can never visit until their existence ends here on earth. This is one of them. Don't worry, your dream is about to become a reality. Let's go. <sighs> Welcome, both of you, to the shrine of Nzeka. Haji Kukukuri Lele Abele. Be damned. How is this possible? The great wise Agwante. The great son of Odumegu. The grandson of Ebubedike. Hmm. Mbume, abu mordobu, nemu muram kesi ama mabwa kerega, mpiyele lumu woyara lalo na toto. The champion of Omweme. Both of you are welcome, my son. We greet you. You are welcome. Thank you. <laughs> you are, you are indeed the son of your father. <laughs> Both of you can see it. Mu mwaba naka mwaba jiri ya jabe mwaha. Njamata mabu 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 afifia. Kanda George yibebu. Kamara mabu 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 afifia. Gini kana hatum. Njamara mabu 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 afifia. Heje yibebu. Buniyana mu ijeri ma. Buniyana mu yore ma yibebu okoko. Buniyana mu bumen bumen jire na jofia. Mwe kande fwego. Bumen jire na jofia ni. Okay. 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 What about Freke to put them in? I got three Gangine Bush in your room. 
I am that I am. I. <clears throat> you are welcome, my son. <laughs> Thank you, the wise man. <sighs> you are welcome. <laughs> the son of Odwe. <laughs> Hurry, you are welcome. <laughs> I know you. I know your name. <laughs> In fact, I was there when both of you agreed to consult me. As I would, and then I would come back. <laughs> but the question is do you want your throne back? <laughs> Agree with you. Why else do you think I'm here? <laughs> Please, do not confuse the gods. I demand answer to my direct question. Do you want your throne back? Yes. There is nothing I desire more than sitting on my father's throne. <laughs> when roots are deep, there is no need to fear the wind. Because the living and the dead are one. It is only a child that fears the face and the picture of the devil. <laughs> Do not think there are no crocodiles just because the river is calm. I don't understand why it's one. Mbume! <sighs> Mbume, Igwam Nanten, no, you pull along a warm air cape in Yanamano Katakatanika, Macanamuni, if you will fool. Now, listen. You will run mad for two weeks, and after that, <laughs> the whole crown will be yours. Mad out like. Ah! Ubeka neck and as a woman of Anu, great one. Thank you very much. Boa Anu give. What? What? Ah! No! From the innermost chambers of the ancient chimatar. No, Prince. Prince Harry. No, my Prince. You must be out of your mind to think I'm going to go berserk on the streets for two weeks. Do you know what that will do to my reputation? My hard-earned reputation. A gubernatorial hopeful. The darling of the press. The ambassador for African youths. Do you know what that will do to me? Don't be ridiculous. That will never happen. No! My prince, trust me. Relax. Most of the men you see out there, wealthy and influential, passed through this path. You have only two weeks. Two weeks 
and all you seek will be yours. Two weeks is so easy for you to say. Did all your friends roam wild in the streets before they got answered prayers? What are you talking about? Prince Harry, tell me. Tell me what you're worried about. What if I turn up dead before two weeks elapses? Oh, relax. Don't even go there. I already have that sorted out. Come on. Be a man. Obidimpa. My king. <laughs> let's go, let's go. <laughs> my governor. <laughs> for two weeks. I don't like it. My prince, we must succeed. And if we must, this is the way. Hard way remains the only way. Locking me in here for two weeks? <laughs> now I can see you want to kill me. If I had wanted to kill you, I would have done that long time ago. <laughs> My prince, meet the former. She will be the one to take care of you during the course of your time out. Yes. Ifoma, meet Prince Harry. Nice to meet you, Prince Harry. Same here. Kingsley, are you sure this will work? My prince, I want it never fails. And he will not start with us. Ifama, your job starts now. Okay. Um, my prince, you need to change into this so that we'll take you from there. Picking up your calls now. Well, if you were not blind, I would have said you missed the fucking lot. Very nice of you to say that. Chioma, I want you and your husband to stop further attempts to reclaim my husband's throne. You mean my husband's throne, Sandra? Why are you so stupid and proud? 
why not advise your husband to let go of what does not belong to him? Because you know very well that that throne is my husband's. Hmm? Take a good look at me. Take a lovely look at me. You would agree that I am a better queen than you would ever be in your miserable life. <laughs> you wish. Now listen, you mad dog. Get your box and your crazy ass self out of my way. Scared to admit the truth? Listen up. I am a moving train. Nobody dares stop me. If you do, I'll crush you. And that includes your miserable husband. Well, a bomb can stop a train, my darling. Do not forget that. <laughs> Don't stand in my way. I can see someone has decided to beat the drum of war. Hmm. Now I see. You enjoy attention so much. Well, news flash. I am not the best match for you. Oh, sorry to bust your bubbles. I don't know what you're talking about. Sandra, you know damn well what I am talking about. Oh, you finally carried your threats, right? Because you and your husband know where my husband is. And I will take my pound of flesh, Sandra. I will. That's your cup of tea. Why not be a kind old bitch and take your filthy self out of my compound now? Really? Oh, then get ready to drink that tea with me. Because, Sandra, Sandra, I will serve you a tea so hot. Hotter than anything you've ever had in your life. Do not mess with me, Sandra. Oh, please take your trumpets to the express. Hmm. Listen up. The throne is for me and my husband to keep. I see. You looking for your husband? Go to his political parties. Or you can as well go to the court. Or rather go to some dustbin. Where you can find him and stop pestering my peaceful life. You will definitely hear from me, Sandra. You and your husband will hear from me! I am Queen Sandra Odu Amy, the Queen of Dunu Kingdom. Nobody can take my throne. Nobody can take my place. Nobody born of a woman can take my position. What's going on here? I heard voices. Why were you two arguing? Argue? A queen doesn't argue. Really? Sandra? Why do you like raising your shoulder like a peacock? As if you're the only one existing on this palace. Well, let me tell you something you don't know. First of all, you are not the queen yet. And secondly, you are not worthy to be one. <laughs> My daughter, it shall never be well with whosoever says my children will not get what right will be lost to them. Lie, lie. Amen. My daughter, don't you ever give up on your fight. 
You can imagine her mother carrying herself like a Zenway. Ma Pompo Hare, I am the mother of the, the, the governor. I am this, I am that. Hey! Me, you need to see her. Ma, don't worry yourself. See, whatever game she is playing, I am equal to the task. <laughs> don't you trust your daughter again? Okay, huh. Hey! I tell you go why. Okula Kalisa. Hey! My daughter, that reminds me. Remember you promised to bring us some items, eh? Did you bring them? Mama. You know there's no way I'll forget that kind of a promise. I came with them. They're in the car. In the car. Hey! Again, it again, it No, That is the man who kidnapped my husband because of the throne. Arrest him. Arrest who? Arrest your husband. Are you out of your mind? How can you accuse my husband of kidnapping your husband? Are you not? <laughs> well, mad dog, I don't have your time today. When I have your time, you will know. Arrest this man. Excuse me. I'm Detective Mark from the first headquarters. You are under arrest for the kidnap of your brother. Well, Detective Mark, how is it even possible that I will kidnap my own brother? That's your head off. All right, proceed to that when we get to the station. Show me what has come over you. Mm -mm. Victor, I should be the one asking you what has come over you. Really? Because of the throne, you went as low as kidnapping your blood. Maybe because you're married to this mad, mad dog. Now you're beginning to think like that. Please arrest this man. Prince Victor, let's go. No, sis. It's all right. I'll ride behind you. Huh? Very well then. No, this is Shoma! Not... Shoma, have you gone mad? How dare you? Hmm. How dare you bring the police into my father's palace to arrest my brother for something he know nothing about? Oh, really? Or oh, maybe I am going about this the wrong way. No, 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 no. You know something about your brother's kidnap. Now, where is your brother? No, 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 no. Go fight my husband. You oh, have really gone mad. No, you are the mother of No, father of that. Oh, no, Everything is not all right. My brother Victor was arrested by the men of the police, led by Choma. Hey! How can that be? Honestly, I don't know. She's accusing him of being the brain behind her husband's kidnap. Oh my God. My mother wants you in the palace immediately. Uh, it's all right. Um, please, just give me a moment. Okay. I'm coming. Okay, sir. Hello, oh, please hurry up! Let's go through this one more time. Where are you keeping your brother? Officer, I've told you this before. And I'm telling you again, I did not kidnap my brother. What the hell would I kidnap my brother? Because you have refused to give him back his throne. And that's not enough reason to hurt him. Especially my own blood. What's all this? Officer, this is so unfair. Why would you arrest someone without properly investigating your claims? In case you don't know, I am the crown heir. The more reason we are having this conversation. Where are you keeping your brother hostage? I get so aggressive when my questions are not answered. For the last time, where is your brother?
up soon. Mom. You're welcome. Thank you. I hope they didn't hurt you. No, Mom. I'm fine. Thank God for the quick intervention of our lawyer. Mom, I miss Dad. I miss him more. He would have done something. Harry is still missing. I don't know where he is. I just hope he's not one of those that are politically related issues. I'm sure it is. They've been going to court, so... It should have a lot to do with politics. Of course you know these people are so unpredictable. I just hope my son is all right wherever he is. I hope same too, mother. Mom, I need to go inside. I'm very, I'm very tired. Of course you need to do that. You know, I like, I like food. Food! <laughs> Hey babe, what's up? I'm fine. Oh, you look so beautiful this afternoon. Thank you. Wait now, I'm talking to you. I said I'm fine now. Didn't I say I'm fine just now? I like you. Thank you. I said I like you. I said thank you. Yeah, I, I, I like you. Ah! Get her, get her! Get her, get her! Stop it! Stop here! I said move! Jeez. I did not do it! Sandra, tell Neka to come back home and cook. Oh. If she's expecting me to cook for her while she's at the palace doing nothing, <laughs> she fed because I'm not going to cook anything for her. Did you hear that? Mama, calm down. Neka is not here. Neka is not there. Are you serious? I'm sure she brushed off somewhere on her way home. Hi. Hi, this girl. Anyway, I have nothing to say. I am here waiting for her. I will sit here and wait for her till she returns. Eh? I am waiting for her. I win my daughter. Hmm? You take good care of yourself too, oh? Okay. Is everything all right? It's my mother. She's worried about my sister. This is strange. She ought to be home by now. Well, every girl makes a stopover, just like he used to do. <laughs> so do not worry, she will soon be back. I'll see you later. Wait a minute. I hope this is not what I'm thinking. 
Choma kidnapped my sister. <laughs> oh no. <clears throat> because of that, they to make their stand before we the royal families to avoid the cruise. Yes. Coupled with the fact that uh, the time frame given to them is short. Short. Uh, but in your mind, when do you think we can schedule the meeting with them? Well, I suggest on know your day. I'm sure you get that. This coming earlier? Yes. Mm -hmm. I'm already engaged that very day. I need to go and inspect the people working on my farm. But, but why don't we leave it on a, a for day? I'm very free that day. Well, if you so so, I'm from others. That's all right. That's all right. Oh. <laughs> I forgot that uh, the color is before us. That's not just a guess and I can't. Oh, cool. I'm going to do a guy. I'm going to do a guy. I'm going to do a guy. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Come, man. I'm going to do a guy. Kai. Matilda, what will you have me do? For over a week now, my husband is missing. Choma. You cannot take such rash decision. Someone might get hurt. I don't care. See, whatever that gets that slimy bitch hot increases my lifespan. I am not against that either. But going as far as getting your fingers burnt bothers well, me. I hope no one gets hurt after this. Victor knows what to do. All he just needs to do is hand over the throne to my husband. That's it. Peace will reign. Choma, why can't you concentrate on finding your husband first and leave all this throne issue? Yes. What is it with you? Mother, Victor, we can't just sit like this and not do anything about Harry's disappearance. What will you have me do? Tell me. Because calling Choma at this point will be a total waste of time. Trust me. I already lodged the report to the police. Hopefully they will come up with something reasonable. And I also have been working round the clock, telling people about it. Oh God. Not this time. What is happening to our family? All our father's legacy is fast tearing apart. Calm down. Our father's legacies are intact. If Harry had kept his words, I'm sure he would be here. Do you have anything to do with it? Have you gone mad? Have you gone mad? How dare you accuse me of my brother's disappearance? Are you sick in the head? Oh, that's okay. Enough. Enough, please. Mind your words. That's okay. And you watch your mouth. Mama. And who let the puppy out? Mad dog, why are you blocking my way? What did you do? Excuse me? Oh, cut me some slacks and stop pretending like you don't know what I'm talking about. I know what you did. Do not forget that two can play this game. But there will always be a winner. Why do you always like taking a plot at the wrong place? Learn to stay in your space, hey. woman. Zip. 
I'm not here for you. You will get my message soonest. Hmm. Tangela is not here. Yeah, well, this is the luggage. Because we are shipping by Tangela. I need that for Tangela. security, the DSS, the soldier, and the SAS, call them, I need them now that this attack is high. You know? Mama, you see, you see what I've been hammering me. Stop all this bonus and announcing yourself as, as governors this, governors that. Besides, we're not even running for the race anymore. Mama, stop putting yourself in danger because you hear you call all these names and they will think you, 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 you have somebody there. Excellent. Miko, uh, I, I don't want you to add to the attack I had. Miko, listen, you're saying all this because you have always wanted small things instead of bigger and mightier things. Huh? Miko, don't tell me this kind of thing again. I don't need it. The, the attack I had, uh, 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 I had uh, 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 before coming here is too much and my blood pressure is about to rise. Miko, call your husband. Call your husband, I need security. Let him bring soldiers. Let him bring soldiers to guide me. Her Excellency cannot be moving around without security. This attack is high. Hmm? The attack came with, with high frequency and you're, you're talking like this. Biko, don't provoke your mother. Mama, I've not seen my husband for days now. Hmm? I am under a lot of pressure. I'm sorry you almost got kidnapped. But my husband is missing. Uh, which husband are you talking about? His Excellency, my son in law, the governor. My husband. <laughs> that can't be true. <laughs> you just can't tell me that. How can you say that a governor is kidnapped? Governor cannot be kidnapped. Politicians have their way to hide when attack comes. When they have security, you ignore me. <laughs> you don't know the game. My in law cannot be kidnapped. <laughs> Mama, let me you're hear you. Let me you're, hear you. If my in, if they kidnap governor, then me, I won't work hagan. Don't say, don't just tell me such a thing. I know that once I have this security that I'm asking for now, if DSS is there, SAS is there, uh, police is there, let me see who will come into my compound to come and attack me. Let me show them how excellencies behave. A political woman like me, they are being attacked. Please, uh, Choma, please don't tell me that thing. My in law, in fact, I think I need to call him myself because my Choma they are cooperating, so it's only a matter of what's up. <laughs> My daughter don't know the eating. Bring the food, I'm home. What? <laughs> Sandra. You mean you want me, Kingsley, to betray my bosom friend? Betray y'all? Come on. You can do better than that. Haven't heard the word motivational speaker. I want you to be his hardcore motivator. Pressure him. 
pressure him to fight for the governorship. Let him concentrate on winning the cuts. He should forget about the throne. My husband is the one who the cap fits. Really? <laughs> I think I I can now understand where you're driving at. You know, you've been away for two weeks. Good. That notwithstanding, Sandra, he is in charge of taking his own personal decisions. And I must tell you to your face that I, Kingsley, support his quest for the throne of his fathers. I beg to take my leave. See ya. How is everything going? Everything is fine. How long do you think this job is going to last? Why the question? Are you worn out already? Look, Ifoma, remember that you can ask for anything. I mean anything that you need. So relax and do the job. That's not the issue. I'm afraid of him breaking off those chains and attacking me someday. Oh, no, no. Prince Harry is a perfect gentleman. Do not try such. Okay? Feel free. Relax and do your job. Remember what you stand to gain. Take care of yourself. There is no problem. Of course. You know the deal. I will bring her to you and get my balance. I have told you before, I don't make mistakes. It's the girl. Shit! She's not here! Hurry, 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 hurry! No! Does he always do this? Most of the times, he only stops to eat, and after that, he goes all night long. Anyway, don't worry. Mm -hmm. Keep up the good work. <laughs> Remember, all this will end soon. And your smile. Thank you so much, sir. My prince. Okay. Just... 
Hello? Hello? Yes, I'm going to the chairman's house to pay him, but my daughter is busy. I'm not seeing her for some days now. Yes. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Hey, go no more with no thank you. Hey, Chineke. You be no more no go no get up on a lot of money. You must say it's all for me and my family. Let's go inside. Wait, wait, wait. Wait a second. What do you mean? We do not know where he is. Did he travel or what? This is just so uncalled for. Okay, okay, okay. Your mouth is saying okay, okay. But your face is showing not okay. Mr. Chairman, he traveled to come back in a week. He traveled. What is all this about? to come back in a week time forgetting that we have in fact he, he was supposed to meet with our legal team today are you not aware mr chairman harry odoeni is preoccupied with other important things be rest assured i'll take your message to him have a nice day From the look of things, it seems Prince Harry is no longer interested in the governorship race. Why don't you give the mandate to somebody else? Um, I don't want to consider that for now. Let me just give him benefit of doubt. So, um, do you need anything else? Not now. Yes, darling. Where are you headed to? I thought we agreed you sit at home and plan for your coronation. Well, you are correct. But I cannot keep His Excellency the Governor waiting. I know. But sweetheart, you have to be careful with what you discuss with him. You know he shares the same affiliation with your wicked brother. I'm aware of that. But I did not make the appointment. It was the Commissioner of Chieftaincy Affairs who insisted. You see, he thinks I should get acquainted with the governor. As a matter of fact, he and Harry has fallen out. <laughs> I see. So it means all hands are on deck. And what is the meaning of that? Don't worry. Run along before you hit the traffic. I'll see you soon, my love. Just come in.
Victor. Mom. Yes, ma'am. What has gotten into you? Since when did you develop a heart of stone? For Christ's sake, we are talking about your brother here. Brother turned enemy, you mean? Mom, you were there. You were there when Harry gave up the throne to me. And just when I started getting used to this, after the community crowned me the heir, he appears from nowhere and asks me to hand it back. Who does that? Do you have a hand in his disappearance? Answer me. Because I cannot explain where all this rivalry is coming from. Mom. I'm, I'm disappointed at you. As a matter of fact, I was very busy before you came in. Please, if you excuse me, I have something to do. Victor. Victor. Do not push me too hard. Because you won't like what I will do to you. Victor, answer me! Am I not talking to you? Hello? Yeah, Kingsley. Uh, are you there with uh, Prince Harry? Mr. Chairman, I told you that he went on a short trip. Yeah, he said that was going to last for just a few days. Is there anything you're not telling me? What do you mean? You know what? Um, just forget it. Whenever he returns, just keep me informed. News have reached my ears that you girls are now very nonchalant and reluctant in carrying out your duties in this palace. This should not repeat itself again, else you will not like my fallout with you girls. Get out. Hello. Good day. You're looking for someone? Actually, I'm looking for um, Prince Harry. Over here. Sit. Thank you. Oh. How may I help you? <clears throat> Mr. Kojo. Prince Harry's party chairman. Actually, I was supposed to book an appointment for now, but his phone seems to have been out of reach. Well, he's not here. But hold on. You didn't hear? Hear what? His Excellency disappeared without a trace. Maybe you should channel your energy into making a new governor. I know that look. It's a terrible news. His wife is devastated. I suggest you send some delegates over to her place to perhaps console her. My God. Yes. Who God wants to bless, he blesses. Who he chooses to curse, he curses. Have a nice day, Mr. Chairman. Thank you. Just a reminder. I am Sandra Oduenyi the incoming queen of Dunu Kingdom. Have a nice day. Oh, <sighs> 
Mm. So what you doing out here alone? Mm. Just looking for fresh air. Fresh air? Mm. Why don't we go back inside? So you can give daddy some shit. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. Let's go, okay. Mm. Mm. Excuse you. I would like to know, is this a new form of greeting? When you want me to greet your family, you know what to do. Excuse me. Hey. Hey. Don't let that get to you. Don't let her spoil the fun, my love. <laughs> Are you serious? No, funny enough, I actually thought about it. I think your idea is a nice one. Yes, because um, a deal worth 10 million would actually need plenty of attention. <laughs> Okay. Uh, greetings, mother. Keep the greetings to yourself, Sandra. Let me quickly call you back. What's going on? What's the problem? You're asking me what the problem is. Sandra, why are you not showing concern about Harry's whereabouts? What's your point? Really? Are you the one asking what my point is? Sandra, maybe you have forgotten. Let me remind you. I remember correctly the first day my son introduced you to me. And I welcomed you into my family despite all your negative actions. What is it? Let me tell you, Sandra. Chioma needs all the emotional support she can get from you. I am so surprised. But I've been doing all that. Really? I've been trying my possible best to make little inquiries about Harry. I mean, you don't expect me to die before my time all because of him. Come to think of it, he might be somewhere enjoying the best of his life and you're here, bordering yourself. I beg nothing. your pardon. Don't beg, please. It's your responsibility as a mother to be worked up over him, not mine. He is your son. Let's learn to differentiate the priorities. Thank you. Choma. Choma, you have to hurry up. Choma, if you must see the party chairman, you have to hurry up. I heard the chairman will be going out in the next one hour. Are you serious? Yes, we have to ask him of your husband's whereabouts. And who is that crazy person trying to knock down my gate? You know, say you say me I no open gate for her. I no go open now. Just open the gate. Let the dog in. What are you doing here? Now get out of my house. I just called you in to tell you to get out of my house. So get out. You know, in few days, I am going to be queen. And you know, as queen, we expect all doors to be opened. My dear mother-in-law insisted I check up on you. So how are you doing? Are you depressed? Suicidal? You know, I'm only concerned because I wouldn't want any form of cuss around the throne. Mm. Sandra, you know you're not welcomed here. So why don't you get your crazy ass 
out of my house. I know I am never welcomed in this cat on your color house. But my dear mother-in-law and sister, like I said earlier on, that I check up on you, you know, to know about your husband's disappearance. You know, it must have been very sad for you. How are you taking it? You know, I have never been in your shoes. It must be lonely. So my love, how are you coping? Are you good? Sandra, old witch, <laughs> you know you can never and will never, not while I am still breathing, be the queen of this kingdom over my dead body. So quit dreaming and get yourself out of my house <laughs> right now. Chioma, you forget things so easily. You've suddenly forgotten that we're in a rat race competition. And unfortunately, I am winning. <laughs> Listen up, the elders have decided to hasten our coronation. So when next I come visiting, I am definitely coming as your queen. <laughs> no cap. <laughs> The Board of Trustees, who have been trying to reconcile the both candidates, has been calling for my resignation as the party chairman. Chairman, sir, nobody is blaming you. Our candidate, Harry Odwin, must surely return. Trust me. Not the same. We are talking about our party not losing our seats on this upcoming election, all because of Harry. People think he was cheated out. And because of his, his absence, we're having huge disunity amongst us. <sighs> Philip! Yes, boss. Please get me the phones at the drawer there. Okay, boss. Right away. Well, um, <clears throat> Mr. Chairman, I I think I'll take my leave now. Okay. Mm -hmm. Philip, where are you? Boss, don't forget you have an appointment by 3 p.m. With who? Lily and Sons. Okay, 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 okay. Um, I'll, I'll... Should you be asking me that question? Your calendar should always be handy. Yes! Yes! Finally! 
can you please unchain me? I smell like a corpse. I don't know why people didn't even bother to clean me up. <laughs> I risk calm. Please. Oh yes. Oh yes. Oh. <laughs> Come on. Take it easy. It's only for two weeks. <laughs> Finally. I cannot wait to take my rightful position as the king of King Kingdom. Yes. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, my prince. First things first. We need to clean up. <laughs> mm. Yes. Take a drastic decision. How can the coronation be postponed? <laughs> These people are daring me. They are playing with fire. I cannot come this far only to back off like it never happened. No. I need to do something. I need to do something really, really fast. Williams? See me as soon as possible. As a matter of fact, it's urgent. It's a matter of life and death. <laughs> Thank you very much. Background friends. Greetings. Greetings. Yeah, well, Greetings. My grand friends. Do you catch on? Yeah. Um, I greet everyone in this meeting. I don't know. Four weeks ago, we took a decision that the coronation be postponed pending the resolution of the differences between Prince Victor here and his elder brother, Harry. Yes, yes. Zale. And today makes it exactly one month when we took that decision. Wow. Secondly, for two weeks now, Prince Harry had been missing without a trace of his whereabouts. And you all will agree with me that that automatically puts on hold the coronation until he is found. You are right. I hope I have spoken your mind. 
Yes, 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 yes. we know. my phone. My prince. Where have you been all this while? What happened to you? My prince is aware of Now that you are here. We want to know if you and your brother have agreed to move the crown to another family or your younger brother Victor, the crown king. None of the above. Over my dead body would he be crowned king. I want my throne back. And over your dead body it shall be. Over your dead body it shall be. Okay. Oh, I called your lines, they were dead, and I decided to check here. I first check your house in the morning. Have you seen that everything is a total waste? Your native doctor, your guru, your seer, whoever he is, is a fluke. Now my younger brother has been confirmed king. My friend, we can still find a way around all of this. I mean, we can fix it. Fix what? Are you deaf? Didn't you hear me? I said he's been confirmed king. I've lost. I am a loser. I gave up the throne of my father and now I have lost the opportunity of becoming the most powerful man in this state. No. No. You are never a loser. And you can never be called a failure. Listen, friend. Believe me. There are things we can still do about this. I mean, we can still fix it. Trust me. We can still fix what? Will you give me back the two weeks that I was vulnerable? Will that come back to me? Do you know I could have been killed in this city? I wonder why I even listened to you compromising my faith. Your Majesty. I want to be left alone. Now. Yes, now. 
Very, very yes. I, I don't I don't know how to make you understand that I'm that I am happy. Mama. <laughs> very happy. <laughs> Till one. God has already destined me to be Alpha Mu Mueka brother. Omobo. Mama Mune governor. Do you know the kind of respect I command in this village? Oh, one naga hane butam. Naga hane butam. They must be reeking in laughter watching you parade yourself as Mama Mune governor. Whereas your daughter is not governor's wife and will never be. Mama, stop it now. And stop it, you're disgracing me. Chama, <laughs> what you know? That's why you're talking like this. Ika Mwata Kiri! And all the game of Anna. We are governor today. Genti Chi. Game on top Your husband is destined to be something bigger than that wooden throne with few hungry looking elders nodding their head like they fell from Miracle Tree. Ne. Muranya. <laughs> okay, fine, I believe you. Can peace reign now? I don't know. But I don't know political affairs. I don't know political affairs. I need me political affairs. And we're political. Pigadry. Higri day. Biko, what's up? Mama, to a man for Biko. Mama, but your daughter is no longer. She won't want to kill him off. I am a sad. To a man for. Are you sure about that? While I was praying, I saw your father. He was very sad and unhappy. Lamenting about the problem you have with your brother. Please, do, does he blame me for everything? Is he unhappy that I did what I did, ceding the throne to my younger brother? No, not exactly. He was only worried about peace returning to his dynasty. Prince, your future is bright. You still talk about the future. What is there in it? I almost have lost everything. I have lost the position as the heir to the throne. My governorship ambition, which I worked so very hard for, is gone with the wind. It's obvious that I was never fit to step into my father's shoes. Prince, listen to me. Listen. Have faith in God. Trust him. Follow his ways and he will make your path perfect. Make peace with your brother and leave the rest to God. Trust God, okay? Trust him. Hmm. Yeah, I'll get you. I'll get you. Nah, Stop wasting my time fast before I, I will miss this bus. Hey. What? I'm coming. Fast, please. Excellencies, don't make night movement. Where are you? Very heavy. Don't cut my bag. Don't dirty it though. I carry this in this group. No, I thought I thought I would be following you to the city. Yes, uh, it's true. I plan taking you along, but uh, you know how everywhere is now. No place is safe. And uh, as Mother Excellency, I'm always at risk. Okay, mom, you're too young to take such a risk. So. You have to relax for now. Let me go. Oh, yeah, let's go. Okay. When when will I be coming to that city? When will I be coming? Don't worry. Let me let me go first and come back. Yeah. When I come back, we will plan that and decide when you will follow me. Yo. Let's go. Okay. And then how can I stay in this big house all by myself? <laughs> get it. Okay. Get it. Listen up. You are now an, uh, a daughter, a grown up daughter excellency. What did I say? You are now a grown up daughter. Excellency, so you should learn to be sleeping alone because sometimes I'll be going to political appointments very soon. But never mind, I've already made arrangements. My sister's, my sister's daughter will come and sleep with you. You are not alone, and very soon I will get bodyguards to be guiding you. In my neighbor, daughter, daughter, excellency, I listen. This is, this should not be a chance for you to be patrolling all over the village. Oh. Huh? Don't go and disgrace me. Mm. Remember who you are. Oh. 
Doctor Excellency, so can you probably go? So you don't try to kill our political. You know, sometimes they get And as an excellence, do I even have to work this way? <laughs> carry that, carry that bag with packaging. Oh. So don't disgrace me. It's like you don't know my mother. She has already made plans for her sister's daughter to come and be staying with me. If her sister's daughter do not come, her so-called bodyguard will come to so protect her. Her daughter is selling. Bodyguard. Yes. <laughs> bodyguard. Yes. Bodyguard. Call. I mean that way. You know, I will be talking about is going to call the T S. Digging. S S. Digging. T S S. The S is secret. It is actually your majesty from now onwards. Remember? That's true. So now I am the queen of Zulu Kingdom. Hmm. I'm relieved that finally everything has been settled. Of course. Mm. Hey, princess. Please, can you excuse me? But I'm family. You can accommodate me in your discussion. My queen, I think I'll be with you downstairs. All right? Okay. Good. Mm. Okay. Sis, what is it you wish to discuss with your king? Brother. Don't you think it's high time you reached out to Harry? I am really concerned about his well-being. He has gone through a lot. And now that it's obvious he has accepted defeat, it is only right you reach out to him. You see, you're right. But I have plans to reach out to him after my coronation. He's part of this family. There's no coronation without Harry. Don't you get it? I mean, Harry was the first person to show his commitment to this family by ceding the throne to you. You should do the same. You saw the way he left. Are you sure he still wants to have anything to do with me? Well, you try, I will convince you. I'll think about that, sis. Thank you, brother. Good. <laughs> I need to go meet my queen. Okay, brother. I'll see you, all right? See you too. Yeah. The truth is, nothing in this world can justify the way I acted towards you. I should have at least acknowledged the fact that you give up the truth. 
So on that note, I am very sorry. Although the elders are insisting that we continue the coronation, this is why I've come to ask for your blessings. You did well, Victor. It's okay. You don't need to apologize, Victor. I should be the one apologizing here because I vividly recall handing over that throne to you. You haven't done anything wrong. I am the one who has been on it for a while now. And I make bold to say I'm sorry myself and uh, to specifically ask you that henceforth you go ahead and take the crown of our father. Take what? The crown. <laughs> okay. Because you deserve it. And nothing else will make me happier in this world than seeing you sit on that throne. Shoma, Shoma, you just heard what you said. Don't worry, dear. Just take my word for it. Which word? The throne okay. is yours, and I await your throne. <sighs> Oh, thank you very much about that. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody. The others will hear this. All right. My Thank you very much. All right. Oh, this is good news. Harry. And what was that? No, really, what was that? My darling wife. Calm more down. Calm down. Let him enjoy it while it lasts. I'm sure he doesn't know what's coming. <laughs> oh, this man. I told me, talk, this talk. Man. I told me, talk, I know talk. Who I, am. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I was saying, like you. Don't you know your husband? No, 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 don't do it. Unless I give me a sign. Don't do something. I will not be your fear. No, it needed to be the way you did it so that it would feel like you are actually out for it so that you feel I'm soft and I want him to have it. Hey, hey. An event. <laughs> what event? I mean, you wanted us to go on our honeymoon, and I decided to be a pain in your butt. <laughs> yes, I remember vividly. You locked me up inside the house, <laughs> but I devised a means. Mm -hmm. Bad boy. That's how you kidnapped me from bed in my nineties. Come on. With your suitcases well packed to the brim. <laughs> That was really, that was really fun. I mean, come to think of it. Um, what do you think we try this again? Yes, that's a good idea. You know, I've been thinking about it lately. Mm -hmm. With the events of the past few weeks, one should learn to spend more time with the ones they love. Exactly. Oh, hold on. Is that a yes? We are leaving after the coronation. <gasps> Well, you know now. <laughs> Officer! Today's event 
possible. At this point, Prince Victor Gwen, Olu, we demand you kneel before the truth. Nail down my prayers so that we can declare you the king of Dunu Kingdom. Yes. You can never. You can never. Yeah. You can never. Yeah. 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 The queen, yeah. With the powers bestowed on me as the Undu of Dun and the custodian of our tradition, I hereby crown you the king of Dun Kingdom. Igwe. You may now rise. I hand over the staff of authority, which signifies powers to govern our land. Have it. This one is the Ophon. Ophon 995. Our ancestral offer that existed from the time we never knew. I therefore hand it over to you. This signifies your power, culture, and tradition of our land. And as well as the link between the living and the dead. You have it. At this point, you may choose a title to be known and addressed as. From those days henceforth, I shall be addressed as the Owele of the Mickey. Oh, wait, wait, yeah, wait, yeah, what's wrong? Oh, oh, no, 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 oh, your Majesty. Yes, your Majesty. <laughs> Call me that. Your Majesty. <laughs> I like the sound of that. Oh. And you see a lot of The Queen. Yes. The Queen. Have that and come shine. <laughs> Isn't that high? Why is it here? I thought it was I thought it was too. Even if I will stand by you. Come on, Jesse. Harry. 
Congratulations. What? Your Highness. Did you hear that? I didn't. Why had it? He came to congratulate what? me. <laughs> Harry, my brother. My brother. <laughs> well, thank you very much for making it. It's our family legacy. I must be here. Of course, of course. Super proud of you, Your uh, Highness. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> I like that. <laughs> I'm glad you all came. Yes, I have to. My prince. Family heritage. My that? prince. What are you doing here? Prince Harry, I bring you good news. There's a new development. What? Listen to me. The last time you told me something like this, my mandate was taken away from me. Now do not start. Not from that this time. <laughs> but, <clears throat> my dear friend, I wonder what I will say if you're not getting yeah? I mean, listen to him. Hear him out first before concluding. <laughs> Prince Harry, you see, the Supreme Court have confirmed you the authentic governmental candidate of our party. <laughs> what? And as we speak, the election is just in two weeks' time. Oh my <laughs> no wonder I've had so many missed calls. <laughs> my governor! Oh my god! My advice will go immediately. You go with us. Are you serious? <laughs> Good news. Wow. Oh We're back in the game! Yes. Oh my, my brother! <laughs> my governor! Wow! Oh, 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 where, where are we headed now? <laughs> Thank okay, you. okay, fine. Let's let's hurry. I think you should go with them. Yes, I, I really have to. I really have to at this point because it's important. In fact, I seek your permission, Your Highness. My elders, <laughs> I need to go attend to this. It's very important. Permission granted, Harry. Congratulations. Who is that? I, I, I know, darling, but we're going to the party secretary. Not to worry. In 30 minutes or so, I'll meet you at the reception. The last time you said this, you left me hanging for two weeks <laughs> and left us bickering at each other. I'm so sorry. So I'm not letting you go right now. I promise you this time around, I'm not staying beyond an hour. Trust me, we need to celebrate this, don't promise. you think so? I promise you. Hurry, you need to hurry. All right, bro. <laughs> I'll see you soon. Okay. <laughs> Protocol officer. You're real high nice, sir. Good, good, good. Carry on. Order you to come with me and let's go to the arena hmm. and continue the celebration. I see. <laughs> well, as the first lady of the state, I concur with you, my <laughs> queen. <laughs> and we all Baby. proceed to the arena, please. <laughs> let's go. <laughs> oh, my <goodness. laughs> You said you choose to go to rich people. The point is, you should know that rich men always do things with class. They will come out and start asking you, who is your father? What is your father's name? Oh, it is better my daughter you come down now and wait for the right person. People that are in the same level with us, let them come for you. Mama. Huh? What exactly is the problem now? The problem is that you're going for rich people. And How those people you're going bad? for, is not our, they are not our class. Mama, whether they are our class or not, I have chosen Harry to be my husband. He has asked me to marry him and I said yes. And we are in love, so I don't know what you're saying. Chama, it is not acceptable to me. Okay. Because I, I don't want a situation
mention that tomorrow now you start calling me. Mommy, they, they did this. Mommy, they did that. They called, they asked me who is my father. And they asked me who do I know. And if I know somebody, I should make a call. Like, get, come again. Calm down. Calm down. Right person will come. People of our class will come. And when they come, you will see them. I am speaking to you with experience. I have seen we are rich people. Oh, 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 in, 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 how, how they intimidate people. I have seen how they treat people like us. Because not okay, no. The right person will come. Mama, really, what exactly do you parents want? If I had brought a poor man to you now, you will still complain that he is too poor. He cannot take care of me. Now I brought a rich man and you're complaining that he's too rich. Mama, what exactly is your problem? Because I don't understand. I said I love this man. What you should be asking me, is he a good man? Uh, what, kind of, what kind of person is he? Mama, Mama, see, Harry is the right man for me. I've made my, my choice. He's my last bus stop. I don't know what you're talking about. It's not a last bus stop. Yes, Mama. If you say so, no problem. I'm going to Mm -hmm. Am I the one going there to stay? Oh. You, when, but the only thing is that when it starts, don't don't say I did not tell you. Mama, nothing because is I have spoken as a mother and you don't want to listen. Mama, nothing it's is no, yeah, okay. no problem. If you agree, I have agreed. Mm -hmm. When you're ready, we'll move. Yes, again, and Jane. No, I'm no, no, nothing is oh, happening. My nothing is happening. I will not come back to you for anything. You two don't come to me for anything. When, when I'm enjoying with my husband, living peacefully. <laughs> it's me, your mother. I should not come for anything, Chama. At that time, I'm not the one that is complaining that it's too rich. Oh, but you can do it. Oh, really? Mother, I don't understand <laughs> you. Ah. Oh. Rich men and their wahala, honestly, they run from me. I'm running from them, oh. Yeah, you keep running your... now. That's why you married Papa. Detective Mack. Macking. I'm lost. Who's this and why are you here? Um, first, um, let me apologize on behalf of the Nigerian police for not informing you about this. We decided to come unannounced, avoiding tipping of a green snake held up in this palace. A snake? I don't get it. Um, Sorry, I was just trying to make a point. This rogue here was the one who led the gang that kidnapped your sister. What? Yes. And he has an accomplice. Detective Mack. Mack in. Who's this accomplice? Officer. What? What? The gay. Right. You. I'm not going to explain. Did I not tell you that I don't want to see anybody today? That I want to be left alone? I'm sorry, Majesty. I, I came to see if I can get a, a help from you, Majesty. What is that supposed to mean? 
I came to see if I can get advance payment of my salary, Your Majesty. I think you must be a very stupid man. If you're not stupid, how do you expect me to give you advance payment? Do I look like a microfinance bank or a bank or, or these money lenders that throw money in your hand? Something must be wrong with you. I'm sorry, Your Majesty. It's because of the urgency. Please, Your Majesty. Give my presence. Your Majesty, please. I really need money. Please, Your Majesty. I said, leave my presence. Your Majesty. I said, get out of my presence. Get! Carry okay. me too. I'm sorry, ma'am. Are you blind? I'm sorry, I didn't know you, you were coming this way. Will you shut your dirty mouth? Instead of you to apologize, you're here trying to defend your stupidity. I'm sorry, ma'am. Get out! Poverty stricken son of a nobody. No sense. Let nobody disturb me. Do you hear me? I'm very angry now. Very, very angry. She should go and get another driver to take her to that place. In fact, tell her, tell her I'm not available. Go and tell her. Ah, ah, Deju. We're talking about the Queen of the New Kingdom. Whatever is eating you up should wait. See, it's because of you. If not, she will have to drive herself to that place. I'm tired of all these dirty souls. I'm sorry. I only wanted to get back at the Queen and also for the humiliation that passed through. Johannes, please forgive me. I can't believe this. You mean all this while we've been living with the enemy? We trusted you! We gave you our trust. Opened our doors to you. And all you could do was turn to hot the family that fed you. Detective Mac. My thing. I commend you for the good work. Thank you. And for also ensuring that our family is safe. Please, take him away. It's all yours. Move in. Hey! Come on. Move! 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 Come on! Move, move. move him move. to the car! Enter the car. I said move! Wow! Here comes Her Royal Majesty, the Queen of Dunu Kingdom. You know what? It has been long I stopped over. Wow! The palace is looking quite different. With us too. You know, I am the queen of vibes. I have the magical touch. Magical enough to change the whole world. Anything I touch, turns to gold. Welcome to my kingdom, my lovely friend. You know what? I'm here for vacation. Please, can you show me my room? Don't stress yourself, my darling. I'll have the maids handle that for you. <laughs> Meanwhile, 
We have a lot of catching up to do. Oh my god! Oh, wait, 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 wait. Long live the Queen of Dunu Kingdom. Oh. Our Royal Majesty. My goodness. Queen Sandra. Oh! Wait, wait, wait. Oh. You have changed the pattern of hanging. What happened? That's because I didn't want to choke unnecessarily. Come over here. Oh my god! <laughs> You see, now you are going off to the university. Keep your eyes open. Do you hear me? Face your book, read and do not look at anybody. Your sister made all this possible. It's left for you to make this family proud. Hmm? Yes, Mama. I promise I'll make us proud. I know all the sacrifices she has made for me, and I promise not to fail you. That's my daughter. And I'll miss you. I'll miss you too. Yeah. Yeah. Give me your hands. Let me pray for you. Okay. Long before I was even married to that family. My dear, if anyone would tell me that that man is the mastermind behind everything, I will never believe it. At all. Huh? Well, thank God it has been settled. I mean, who knows what other crime he would have committed now that we have a king, if we hadn't caught him. My love. I'm sorry for accusing you in the past. I can't even remember why we were trying to destroy each other in the first place. Sandra, stop reliving the past. I mean, now we have a king and everybody is happy. So let's celebrate. Hmm? Though, I felt really bad. Because our Buha was practically stagnating our kingdom. Right. So how is your lovely husband, Prince Harry? Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're forgetting tomorrow is election. Oh. Mm. So he's running around, you know. And I hope you are coming out to vote for a new dawn tomorrow. My dear, my PVC mm -hmm. is ready. Right. Tomorrow... I am going to perform my civic responsibility. I, I don't come. I now we stay here. <laughs> oh, please. Gosh, this lady is so funny. Hey, hey. Mama, don't come. Her royal excellency is here. First lady. First lady, I have a right. Your excellency. I am here. Your excellency. Oh, no. oh, no. What do you have? Um, but I think I have to keep this my cap. No, it has been falling off. Come on, come on. 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 Come on, 
my daughter, you understand? You understand? Then I have to drink and get myself a uh, what? Yeah. <laughs> For tomorrow, I did it. So you are not going to be. You are not going to be. You are not going to be. Excellency, <laughs> Your Majesty. Yes. Excellency. Um, oh no. no, no, no. <laughs> Your Excellency. Ah. <laughs> uh. You look good. You too. <laughs> I mean, oh no. Don't no, no, okay. work it. Your Excellency, congrats oh, once again. Thank oh, you, my queen. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh. Congratulations. Finally, you achieved your dreams. I am super proud of you. I could never be prouder of you than now. You are amazing and the crown looks good on you. Oh, true. <laughs> oh really? <laughs> Let's just say, fate played its part. Destiny, if you might add. <laughs> Can I be honest with you? The position of the governor looks good on you. Ah. <laughs> I've always That's known true. that. <laughs> and course. royalty looks perfect on you. Oh. You can say that again. <laughs> <laughs> that reminds me, where's mom? Well, she's inside. I can't wait to see her. I have a surprise for her. Very well then. <laughs> Let us go and surprise her. <laughs> the first. Oh no. Your Excellency, how are you doing? Igwe! <laughs> oh no! 